Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. This is part two of the trailer build. Y'all stick around. Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. Glad you guys stuck around. If you haven't seen part one, the link will be down in the description or up above. Today, I'm going to be clearing out the trailer and hopefully taking it the top off. So that's what I'll be doing today. Let's get started. I gotta get busy. I call you up in the middle of the night Been bothered by dreams, ain't feeling all right you give me comfort, say just give it some time By the end of our talk, I'm feeling just fine You and I will always know where we belong This ain't no ordinary love we got going on I pick you up in my 59 Ford We head on down the road until I love this cooler. I didn't put the cooler on until about after a year on the trip. I wish I did it a lot earlier. Yep, a lot earlier. Everybody else can see where we belong. Oh, ain't no ordinary love we got going on. What about us? Got a text. New phone should be in today. For the time when we be together every day, but I know it's never recording. Alright. Pulling stuff out of the inside of the trailer now. <laughs> Blankets, coats, jackets, stuff like that. Ah, pillowcases. Okay, I'm gonna take this other blanket out and then I'm gonna take the bedding out. Which means you have to move, camera. boxes up and take a break. Uh, almost done. Got a few things here left. It's a little warm today. I'm almost done. I don't want to just stop. I don't think I will. <laughs> passport. National Park Passport. All right, the inside has been cleared out and the trunk has been cleared out. That's one of my major projects today. I got a couple of more things to do and maybe even trying to take, trying to take this top here off, it depends how I 
deep, I'm gonna have to get into that. The end of our talk, I'm feeling just fine. You and I will always know where we belong. This ain't no ordinary love we got going on. And I'm gonna be taking this rack off because it's going into the back eventually because there's a hitch receiver back there and I want to put that back there and with the new setup there's going to be a a windbreaker type thing here so I suppose uh, maybe maybe not I don't know we're gonna have to look at that well that's nice that fit on the first try or if that's the same on the other side it is The next thing is I'm going to take these off because you notice they're loose and they're being replaced with the trailer jack, which I think I have a video on anyway. Uh, but yeah, these are going to come off. that part done now we're gonna have to look at taking these bolts out all the way down cut the wires and need help taking the top off <laughs> about six or eight nuts that we have to cut off. for the trailer in part. Just go see part one. 